गुड इवनिंग एवरीबॉडी टुडे वी विल लर्न हाउ टू मेक डिजिटल क्लॉक इन एस पी डॉट नेट इट्स अ सिंपल डिमॉन्स्ट्रेशन वी विल डिस्प्ले टू यू फर्स्ट ओपन विजु स्टूडियो एंड क्रिएट ए न्यू वेबसाइट्स टेक ए न्यू वेब फॉर्म डिजिटल क्लॉक हेयर द एग्जाम्पल फॉर द डिजिटल क्लॉक डिजिटल क्लॉक फर्स्ट टू लोड द एजेक्स कंट्रोल टूल कैट टू योर टूल बॉक्स दिस इज द सिंपल एजेक्स कंट्रोल टूल कैट हियर द सिंपल एजेक्स कंट्रोल टूल कैट सो ओपन योर ब्राउजर एंड गूगल Ajax control toolkit. That is your core plug site or official websites. You can download from there. Yeah, code Ajax control toolkit dot cloud plugs dot com. You can download here. You can download the binary zip files. From the Ajax Control Toolkit dot cloudplex dot com, uh, I downloaded here already, so you can share this uh, Ajax Control Toolkit 4.0. Now you can add this Ajax Control Toolkit from this method. Choose items. Take some times. Yeah, that is Azox Control Toolkit, and you can download there. And the binary zip files from mm, here and download options Ajax control toolkit 2013 is available here uh, the one component wizard is open here uh, but uh, yeah the choose tool uh, toolbox items so now open your DLL file from mm, using the browser option uh, download Ajax control toolkit and take the DLL file Ajax control toolkit dot DLL and open it here I already add the Ajax control toolkit okay now first add the script manager control from Ajax extension control tab and then add the update panel control update panel control takes the two arg uh, argument content template and the triggers so now here we use the content template and content templates takes the contents of the standards as well as data controls so take the single label control and single timer control so where's the timer control a uh, yeah that is a timer control okay the single timer control the single timer control take the tick event tick Oops. it's not is there uh, single interval control yeah interval is set to uh, 1000 milliseconds means the one second okay now set the timer control property here yeah interval is 1000 and the uh, event is tick so double clock click on it and give the label on tick the event is raised after the interval is completed 
so one second is completed the event is raised automatically so label one dot text equals to date time dot now dot to string oh yeah that is an event okay and save it again and run it again that is an digital clock yeah that is an digital clock after one second is raised 64 56 58 three zero zero two four six nine uh, it sticks some sometimes tonally so that is a digital clock with the date property okay now thank you thank you very much